Welcome viewers, we are doing class 10 MBSC Mizoram board, Maths chapter 10, exercise 10.1. This is in your page number 230 of your textbook, the name of the chapter reconstruction. Let us see the question. We already have done in the construction, this 10.1, 5 construction. Now in the question answers, we have draw a circle of radius 3.2 cm and take a point P at a distance of 6 cm from the center, from the center, remember, of the circle without using the center now, what you do? you are going to draw the draw two tangents to the circle from a point p let us start this how i start here first i will make the circle of that given length what is that radius 3.2 that means 3 and 2 how i am measuring look at here the compass two tips are there 3.2 and this now you're going to make it on the left side of the book text uh, paper and you, whatever, whatever you use because the right side of the book because left side will be used for making the tangent okay this side you are going to make the tangents now this will be your center o which will not be used of course after this now after that you take a point p outside the outside the circle but how far it is six centimeter so let me take this this is at a point here i'll take it somewhere here from this take a little down here maybe more than this here it will be 6 okay so this will be that point from the center 6 centimeter because in the question it is said take that point 6 centimeter away I've taken that now next step is if you remember what we had to do is drawing a secant from that point I made this I will name these things A and b now next was that how long is this line how much is the length from a to this it is 3.3 exactly the same i'll do i'll make 3.3 from in the same line maintain the same line from this 4 3.3 remember 1 2 3 and a little 3 okay so this will be my c here so this way I have made the three things drawing the circle after they taking a distance six centimeter away now and extending this this side same length what is the next next is you are going to make perpendicular bisector of BC this BC so you take more than half about more and more than half and do this doing this down here and the same amount here cutting here and cutting here joining these two lines if you need longer scale you can use longer scale as well but it will do here in this case so I'll use this smaller one when you practice more you will understand how to use the space well so you need more than one practice I, ha I should have been making the dotted lines so if you have made the sharp line what you do is you can cut them somewhere like this okay it's not difficult at all doing this this extra portion you can remove here here also you can remove this clear now what is next here the point where they intersect where this perpendicular bisector is intersecting i'll make it m from m you are going to make a semicircle that will have the radius equal to mc or you can call it mb they will be equal okay they will be equal so either you take mc or mb that is same thing just verify once or twice okay now next is you are going to make a perpendicular at p let's make it don't use very big now make it smaller the way to make your 90 degrees be a little careful in doing this this is how you do one same length 60 two 120 here here is 120 Again, point of intersection 
this is the 90 degree join this these two will be joined here this line we started from p fixed to this one make sure it is cutting the semicircle where it is cutting here i'll call it d now what you do is from p how long is this line from p to d okay measure it and cut it the original circle same done so these are the tangents i need here if i make join this line it will be the tangent p the process we have already done so it should not take long to draw it should be touching here this should touch it here okay you can pass through also you can keep up to that length also no problem this is point is t this point is t dash this is all now the next thing remaining is what drawing the what you have done you have to write in steps of constructions so i'll, I'll do that steps of constructions first thing what we did number one draw a circle of radius equal to 3.2 centimeter remember next i chose the point p take p at 6 centimeter from o o means the center and write in the bracket this o means center after that we made p a b draw p a b s e c a n t second on the circle after that extending p c extend whatever you do same thing you have to write so you can use your english whatever you know p c equal to p a extend p c equal to p a now next draw perpendicular perpendicular bisector bisector of this line bc done which intersects or cuts intersects bc at m when you draw make this it should cut that bc at m now next step is what from m draw semicircle remember we did this semicircle of radius what was the radius chosen mc or you can choose mb also okay you have done that next step you remember what we did here we make a perpendicular from p draw per pem perpendicular from p on bc such that it cuts or intersects the semicircle remember one is full circle what is semicircle this time semicircle which cuts the semicircle means this is cutting the semicircle at d done next now number eight from p cut arc on the original circle we are cutting this origin on the original circle original circle taking p t taking length of p d taken this cutting this too which cuts it on or at t and t dash this is cutting at t and t dash next step number nine join p 
pt and pt dash which are the required tangents okay whatever you did you just simply rewrite it